Other news tonight, Kern High School District is taking an old school teaching method and making it all new again in the name of preparing students for the workforce. Eyewitness News reporter Jeff Platt shows us the Regional Occupational Center where students aren't just being taught facts, they're being taught a profession. Jeff? That's right, Dave Rochelle. The ROC offers more than 20 programs in which students can earn both college credit and also get professional certifications. They call it career and technical education. You may remember it as vocational school, but this is much more than just wood shop and home ec. These teens are learning to do the jobs of the future. There are high school robotics classes all over the country, but none like the one in this room. These current high school students are learning how to build, program, and fix robots. According to the instructor, Stephen Mears, these same robots are taught at MIT and are used in major manufacturing plants throughout America. This class has technology in it that is immediately applicable upon completion of the course. The students in this class learn everything from 3D printing and rapid prototyping to robotic arms like the one Edgar Alvarado is programming now. How we could use robots without no humans. When Edgar told his parents about the ROC course, they thought it was a joke. But after seeing what Edgar has learned to do in just a few weeks, he says their support is through the roof. Now, now they think they actually, they actually have a future for this, that it'll, it'll make a better future for me and later on generations. Also in this class, students learn to program humanoid robots like this one. Joanne Barnes programmed this entire robot dance in just a few minutes, and she's taught the robot to do a lot more than that. I put my hand over his eyes, and he'll be like, I can't see. Yeah, that's just, I don't know. That's just the coolest thing. Joanne didn't know much about robots and engineering before she started the ROC course, but now she's planning to make a career of it as an engineer in the Navy. It's only been a few months and I feel like I'm just so proficient at every, like, you know, everything, like knowing and everything. So like by the end of the year, I think going into my career, I'll be really experienced. That's the point of this course and every course at the ROC, to make sure Kern County has hireable youth coming out of high school, not just today, not just tomorrow, but always. One thing that I really stress to students is to not be afraid to be a visionary, not be afraid to think about the future and, and how you want to interact with it. Don't just let the future steamroll you. I, I want students to go, no, not only do I want to participate in the future, but I want to, I want to mold it and sculpt it into what I believe it should be. And thanks to this class, all these students already have one foot forward into that future. In Bakersfield, Jeff Platt, Eyewitness News. Now, the robotics engineering course actually goes on throughout the entire year. It's three hours a day, five days a week. And if you watch tomorrow night, we'll be showcasing the veterinarian technician and plant production courses taught on the ROC farm. Live in studio tonight, Jeff Platt, Eyewitness.